finish out. Gonna do a little work on that later tonight. Starting to get some of the wires pulled through and tucked away, making the side look kind of clean. Uh, the other side won't be as clean. Most of it's all pulled through on this side. A couple more of the wires will have to be stretched and pulled back through, back into the engine bay for some other connections. But we're getting there. For those who don't know, this is a 91 Honda Accord, sitting with a 4.6 liter V8 out of an F-150. Doesn't look like it, but it is. Alright, so we got everything pretty much plugged in on this side, except for this plug and this one. These two are going to have to get stretched for the air intake, so, so the, let's see, this sensor and this one that's inside the box, so these two have to be moved. So I'm using something like this, so that one's going to have to be taken off, because that's for the Ranger. And that one's actually inside this big air filter box so I can disassemble it and mod a new one up for the intake. So those are the only two lines that have to be moved besides the windshield wiper one. What is underneath here, what I'll stretch in, make a new harness for as well. So three on this side, everything else is good. Well, the headlight plugs and everything reach to where they need to on both sides. Uh, airbag, center thing, yeah, don't really need. Uh, power connections, uh, we'll have to make new end fittings. Make a nice little neat port for it here. Uh, got the solenoid, uh, two other little ones for the air because of the vacuum and everything. Everything is all tucked up nice and neat in the back, so when the shroud goes on, it will look clean in this corner. Besides the airlines, what still need to be, or AC, what needs to be run. Two or three of these lines, I think these two and this one, and uh, one more will have to be stretched out into the cab or out of the cab into the firewall for two extension plugs out there. And then I think the rest of the wall connect into this big mess over here. And I'll just be tidying up and then figuring out the heating box, what's getting put in here, and stuff like that. Wood stove is cranking away. It's definitely a cold ass fucking night. Probably about one degrees out. It's shop about 60, but you can feel the cold air coming in. test of the interior lighting for the engine bay.
Well, I'm done for tonight. Catch you guys on the next one. Subscribe, like, and share. Thanks. Have a good night.